Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Pokemon Coliseum. Um, I'm recording the second episode right after, so hopefully the first episode does well. Um, we've just got to go get some Pokeballs now, so let's go to shop. And here we are. Hello there, you. I don't have any Pokemon, but I come here every day. Why? Hello there, friend. Bye. Oh. Not got any. Um... I don't know. So you don't have any uh, up here. Antero, I know all that stuff. Oh. So yeah, you, there's a call feature in battle. So if they fall asleep, you can just hit call, and it wakes them up. That's interesting. Oh. Why does no one sell Pokeballs? What do you sell? Oh God, no. Right. So we need to go to the ice cut stand. Uh, see what I mean? Baggage just gets right in the way. Baggage just gets in the way and stops you from doing things, doesn't it? Anyway, right, let's get right back in and... We've actually, we're going to get our first Pokemon this episode, I think. I hope so, because in this game, um, you don't exactly battle every single trainer twice, so if you don't catch a Pokemon or if you defeat it, then you're kind of screwed. Which can be really rough when it's some really tough ones. Right, so does this guy sell Pokeballs? Hey you mate, black market dealer. Listen pal, if you're intending to travel. Pokeballs. Oh, so there's just no wild Pokemon here? Hey! Ah, oh, five Pokeballs, traditional. Yeah mate, I'm gonna buy more. Pokeballs and Great Balls. So wait, I've got all that stuff, so... Buy a couple of Great Balls. Because they'll be useful. Okay. Um, he didn't have any potions, but he did back there. That's so weird. Alright, Willie. Oh. They're hunting me down. Right, so all we can do is go back to Fennac, I guess. See if the mayor's able to help us out now, because he said, just go see the stadium. Oh no. Whole lot of scary men. Two creeps in the truck. Oh great. We got baddies. We got baddies looking for us. Let's go talk to the mayor. Mayor S. Kid. Oh. Now, guys, this is the one, the only Myror V. You'll know the theme music. Ah, <laughs> oh, wait, we don't get his music just yet. Yes, my name's Angus. He's the disco dancing bad guy. You can see ordinary things people aren't supposed to see, like Shadow Pokemon. See, they make Shadow Pokemon. Oh, are you going to give me some pain? So these guys, these three guys, blue, red, and green. So they give you your star. So whichever one you battle, you get that one. So I think I'm going to go with uh, red, because I know that mm, green's not, green's worthless in this. But I think red's worth it. Or do I for Algear? I actually don't remember. Let the music spin. Here we go. Ho! <laughs> um. Oh, he bought me again, mate. Ah, oh, bugger it. I think I want. Um. I don't know. God, I like coin toss it. What's more, Lota? Oh, he's got a Lotad. Oh wait, I think we get a Makuhita off this guy. I'm fairly sure. Right. Uh, let's get right into the views. Reflect. If he has got a Makuhita, my Umbreon's gonna get wrecked. Okay. 
So what you got for me? Grell? Nah, I should've used Talon. My poor attack! Oh god, no, astonish. That's not good. Use secret power! For the lols. And use confusion, yes, beyond. Look at my guy, he's so ready, like that awesome, like, Naruto pose. You know, like, arms out. <laughs> so silly. Right, has he got a Makihita? I'll catch it. I don't know if I'll use it, actually. I might as well use it until I get something better, you know? One damage. That'll get that reflect pain off. Oh wait, he's not got one, he's only got two Pokemon. Maybe the next guy. Don't worry guys, it's not always this easy. It does start to get very difficult at some points. A lot of the bosses are really hard as well. Bum bum! Just because obviously you only got two Pokemon so they don't want to like ruin it for you. That's right, Folly, you get tripped up! And all the rooms always like expand in size by like a million. We got Trudley. Trudley and Folly. Myra B. Peon Drudley. Trudley. Was that it? Duskull and Spinarak. Both not good for my Espeon. But both good for my team. Let's Shrek. It's time to Shrek him. He's got three Pokemon. He's gonna have a Makita. Kill him! Woo! Kill him! Look at that Spinarak getting wrecked. I love Spinarak. Oh, so close to level 28. Right, here we go. Level 30. Let's say you know that there's a Shadow Pokemon out because she does this. And that happens. Oh, kill him. So we've got to catch it. We can defeat it, and then we can't get it. Or we can catch it. Well, at the end of the game, you've got a chance to go and get them all. Uh, but, obviously, we're not going to play post-game. There's not really much, actually. But, we will catch it just for the sake of the walls, you know? Right, so, finish that off. And let's use Return on it. See how much this does. Oh, quite a bit. Kill that Dusko! So, with Shadow Pokemon, um, well, I'll explain once we've got it actually. Hang on. Because our case is a little bit different and it's a little bit tedious sometimes, but it's interesting. Oh, he gets cross shop. Oh, oh, God. Right. You taunt, you return, and then we're going to start throwing some Pokeballs. Don't crit. Here we go. Oh, they also get a really strong move. Oh, you get Vital Throw as well? Oh god, that's going to do loads. Ho! My god! Go Pokeball! <coughs> Same rules, free shakes and catch. Hua! One, two, three. Yes! We got a Makihita! Get that into Hariyama. Hariyama! My Pokemon! That's right, your Pokemon! You snagged my Pokemon, that's right. <laughs> Run away! So we did that. So we can now go get our... Oh, oh god, sit down please. Let's get them all back from the bad guys. Eh? Right. So now we're going to get Bayleaf, Quilava, or Croconaw. Just try to remember what they all learn. Um, 
like, there's no point even getting the belief in this game, honestly guys, it'll just bring misery to your life, plus you can get a jump love really easily. Um, water type, you can get a Quagsar, which is good, and fire type, you can get a Slugma, which, depending on your definition, is eh. Um, based on the Pokemon that come up against... Having hmm, Crocodile might actually be the best option. Uh, but I want a, I want a Quilava. <laughs> you know what? We'll be fine. I played this game ten years ago. And I find it hard. I'm sure I'll be okay. Let's get a Quilava. Oh wait, well let's uh, should we lead with Makita? I should explain this. So he's purple. So you know he's shadow. So here's the heart gauge. So as you battle with it, that gradually goes down. Once it reaches zero, when you can do it, you go to this place and it purifies them. Um, they get all their XP because when you battle with them, they don't gain XP. Um, it kind of saves it all. And when you purify them, you get it all at once. So you've got like six levels, for example. Um, your only move right now is Shadow Rush, which is just a shadow type move. Um, it's quite powerful, recoil. Okay. Um, as the meter goes down, you'll get these moves. When you purify, your first move will become something. Oh, sorry. So that's how it works. So we're going with Mac Eater right now. Since obviously it stacks XP, it's good to kind of like make sure everyone gets a little bit. So let's, um, since Espion needs some XP, let's do that, you know? And let's get me a Quilava. Hey, mate. Let us pass. I can take you, mate. Mystery Trooper Russell. This music's so good. Dun, dun, dun. Look at him! So you can only catch a Pokemon when there's one on the field. I, I, I believe. Right, let's use Shadow Rush on that great. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Shadow Rush and Qualava. And you'll get to see what happens. Let's just take it this grimer quickly. Hey! Sweet! Spoink! Oh, he's got smoke screen. <laughs> His fire animation on his back is not great, but fire moves actually did look pretty good. So Shadow Rush. See, he's starting to go down already, see? So Pearl move, move. But you do take recoil damage. Um, right, use it on Spoink. And let's try Return. Hopefully it doesn't do too much. Okay, okay, that's fine. He gets dig? Ooh! I was like, I can only use Shadow Rush, so that means I'm just gonna struggle to death now. Right. So it's good dig. It's underground, so we can't catch it. So, um, let's just reflect and Mac you to kill off this. Actually, no, wait. That's not good. Because Mac Hita might hit with lava. I'm going to switch out. That's a good idea. And you take out Spoink. Go Umbreon! Tactical, see? It's really hard later on. Like later on, you're up against like Pokemon that have like one uses protect, one uses earthquake. Just gets to be an absolute nightmare, and they alternate, so it's just impossible. Right. That's fine. So, let's throw a great ball. Because I'm not risking losing this one. If I don't catch this one, then I'm screwed. I don't get a starter at all. Um, you just use reflect. Come on, Quilava. Come on. 
Hey. You're tough. That's right. That's right. I got clever. <laughs> Artificially closing the door to its heart. Oh, you gotta open the door to its heart. Yeah, it's that cheesy. <laughs> right. Let's go to Pyrite Time. There's a lot more Shadow Pokemon in Pyrite Time. Like, there's actually like a, a ring of like trainers that you just battle and just take each one. Uh, if you don't catch theirs, but they're still there, so that's okay. Some trainers, like, you just don't get a chance to battle again. Right, well, we at? 15 minutes, that's fine. Okay, so. So I have a system. Um, since obviously you don't know the Shadow Pokemon going to level up, I just do level up, switch one out. So level up, switch one out, you know, just do that. Um, so. Don't know its nature yet. Mild, bold. It's got charcoal blades, and we know it's got dig and smoke screen. Hopefully, it's got a fire type move as well. <laughs> and then, yeah, so let's head off to Pyrite Town. Pyrite, Pyrite. Uh, we should get a few more potions, but because I've only got like two of each. Good sir! Yes, hello there! Bye! Get five of each actually, do I? Oh, I need more of them. Thank you, good sir. No, I do not want anything else. Goodbye. Right. Ah. Uh, you guys want to get this game? Just need to download the Dolphin emulator and just the ISO file for this, which you can find pretty easily. It just makes some sense. Um. So you, well, we can only go construction lot, okay. I think we gotta go bit by bit. Oh. What's this place again? Okay. <laughs> Is that like a Coliseum or something? <laughs> Ah, so it is, yeah, it's just a big tower thing. Okay. And then Pyrite should be on. Yep, there we go, Pyrite time. A rough and dirty time full of fogs and scrinders, home of sinister Pokemon. Let's get it! Kill this theme channel. Oh, Mr. Johnson, give me a break here. I keep telling you, I don't know anything. <laughs> Bit of a true kill. Look, he's all hot. Hey there, mate. Tourist. Okay, well. Hello there. Earth, wind, and money. Many near do wells. Hello there. What? Fuck off, mate. I'm good. Oh my god, what the hell? <laughs> Jesus. Uh, okay, save point. So, um. Oh, they're in jail! Hello! <laughs> wow. Is there somewhere I can let them out? Oh, I don't have any. Oh, you can unlock these? Hey there, mate. Okay, then, don't talk to me. Um. Sorry, just a wee explorer, me, you know? What's this? Bum, 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 bum. Hello there. No, I'm okay. 
Russell Bay and Rugg Duking was in charge. There wasn't any of the Lordness you see today. Okay. This is a guy who might be in charge. Uh, there's a Poké Shop. Um, ah, hello. All oh, right. Okay. Okay. Hello there. Okay. Ah, that's handy. Oh, hey kids. That's why Marcia snagged them from. Ah, oh, they're trying to do what I'm doing. Yeah, your little bra is an idiot. <laughs> Okay. These kids are like underground, you know? It's cool. Okay. Look at this guy. Look how big he is. He could take on my Ruby. Oh my god. Who was that kid? Silva. His face looks so scary. Oh, go away, mate. Hello there. Yes, I'm a trainer. Street battles instead of exchanging greens, that's lovely. Come on, my bro! Ah, oh, mate! <laughs> but yeah, this time let me feel a shadow Pokemon, so... I, I don't remember everything. So, let's see what we get. Okay, none of these, so let's start pummeling. So when Espeon levels up to level 27, I'll switch out and I'll switch out Makita if that makes sense. Or what have you. Slack off? Yo, can we get a Slay King? Oh, Hyper Mode. Okay. So what Hyper Mode does, um, if you're in Hyper Mode, your Pokemon is less likely to like, listen to you. If it attacks, it does higher critical hits. But when you call it out of that, um, it's meter goes down quite a bit. So in the right situation, it could save you. In the wrong situation, it could screw you over. See, like that went down by almost half. So you're probably on like a move soon. But like, if you use it and he just ignores you, then that could ruin the battle for you. So it's always good to try and call them out. Hey. Pursuit. God damn it. So many dark type moves. Just the same ones, but oh, okay. No, Makita. Bounce. Bounce back. Boing. <laughs> hey, so we learned focus energy now. So he's got focus energy, vital throw, and cross chop. Now we know. Mate, your team was weak ass. Papa. Yep, I was better than you, Chaser called I don't know if that's a man or a woman. They do not make it easy. <laughs> yeah, I'm just like you. Um, right, I'm going in this one here, guys. Because uh, we're getting quite close to, like, obviously quite a long one. Thanks for watching. And hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Bye.